Welcome back to you all. Wonderful to have you back again to learn and have fun. Today we're going to learn what a life cycle is, study the life cycle of a butterfly, make the life cycle of a butterfly, learn about the life cycle of a frog, and then make your own life cycle of a frog. Activity 1 has some fascinating information about a life cycle. Life cycle means the stages a living thing goes through during its life. I like to see it as a circle going round and round. From the beginning to the end of the cycle, the living creature looks completely different. As they grow, they undergo terrific transformations, a process known as metamorphosis. Study this beautiful life cycle. Can you see the eggs, the caterpillar, the pupa and the butterfly? Don't forget the butterfly is an insect. And we know why a butterfly is an insect. Activity 2. Now make your own life cycle of a butterfly. Make sure you use all these numbers, numbers and labels. Don't forget to use arrows to complete your cycle. So you're going to draw some eggs hatching, then a baby, then a big caterpillar, then a caterpillar that forms a pupa, number five, a beautiful butterfly, and then the butterfly who lays the eggs and the cycle goes round and round. Well done, boys and girls. Activity three, life cycle of a frog. Number one, you can see the female frog that has laid eggs. Then the um, eggs hatch and out comes tiny tadpoles. These tadpoles have external gills and a tail fin. Number four shows the tadpoles with their legs growing. Number five, the tail slowly starts to disappear and then we have number six the mature frog that has developed lungs and lost its gills now boys and girls let's see if you can look around your home and find what different things to make your own life cycle of a frog ready steady go and have some fun Lots more fun to have. You can make your own butterfly. Find a piece of paper and paint one side of a folded piece of paper. So don't forget to fold it first. Then you're going to find some paint, even if, if you have to add a little bit of soil, different kinds of soils, to make a nice color of paint. Then you Paint the one side of your folded piece of paper and you smudge the paint. Carefully open your piece of paper. You'll see the paint is on both sides. Then cut it out, making it look like butterfly wings. Then you can find a toilet roll and use it for the body of your butterfly. Then stick on the wings. And there is your butterfly. Well done boys and girls and congratulations. You have learned so much today. See you next time.